Okay, so we are back to panel number six of our online summit, NACAC Soccer Hub Online Summit. The second panel of today, we will be discussing youth development. What is the best way to scout and identify talent youth players? For that, we invited uh, Lar, Antonio Figueiredo, Barry Gorman, and Bassam Naim. We'll be having Luis Villar um, moderating this panel. So that's why I'm going to introduce him first. Hello, Luis. Okay. Hello. Hello, Luis. Hi there. How are you How doing? Are you okay. Yeah, everything's okay. So are we about to start? Yes. I'm going to introduce now Antonio Figueiredo, Barry Gordman, and um, I'm going to leave so I can put Bassam back in. And uh, I will deliver the panel to you, Luis. Okay. 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 We'll have we'll have about forty five minutes to discuss. Okay. See you guys. See you in a bit. Okay. Okay. So here we are to to discuss the the way we we identify and talent and um, all about the the processes that uh, we we should engage in. So first of all, thank you very much for for having us. Um, I will introduce you, or the best way to do it, I will allow you to 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 talk a little bit about your work and how how your career has been help you to 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 develop this subject. Okay. So let me start by Antonio. So Antonio, um, I'm going to start with you. Um, and let me let me introduce you to to the people that are seeing us, and please tell us how your work and how your academic career has helped you to to work on uh, talent identification and scouting. Hi, Luis. Thank you uh, for the opportunity to to be in this, this forum. So, uh, as uh, Luis said, my name is Antonio Figueiredo. Uh, I'm professionally, uh, I'm a professor at the University of Coimbra uh, and um, during my entire life I have been dedicated to the study and to, the, to be engaged uh, in the, at the club level uh, with uh, soccer and especially uh, with youth, uh, not especially, I, all my uh, activity is being dedicated to youth uh, uh, young, uh, with young football players. Sorry, Antonio. Is everyone listening well, Antonio, or is it just me that it, the, the sound is a little bit uh, short? Is everyone okay? I think maybe the sound could be a little bit better. A little bit. Uh, yeah, Antonio, that's it. So, Barry, are you listening well? Yeah, he's a little bit low. A little bit maybe low, Antonio. Of the, maybe the internet, I don't know. Let me see. Like this. Are you listening? Maybe now? if you if you just took the mics off i'm listening you very low indeed you know guys oh better? Much better, much better. better. Yeah, yeah yeah that's it that's it so let's okay. this way okay, <laughs> okay. so i was telling you that uh, i have been dedicated uh, all my uh, professional life to uh, study uh, young football players uh, and i had the opportunity to uh, work with them uh, at club level in several uh, positions as a coach, as a technical coordinator in a professional club, and as well as a vice president of a prof professional club with full responsibility uh, about the youth uh, department. So um, it was very interesting for me to um, put all together the uh, practical issues with the scientific issues and all my research, that's why all my research is de being dedicated also to um, young athletes, especially to uh, young football uh, players. And so um, it's quite, uh, um, it's very, very interesting for me to have the opportunity to discuss these issues uh, with you guys and to, to share with all the audience. Okay, thank you very much, Antonio. So let us go along with with Barry. Barry, are you listening? Yes, yes. Um... So Barry is a former head coach of Penn State, um, and is telling us a little bit of how we worked in, uh, in in youth development and what's the best way 
to, to scout and identify tel talent. Barry? Uh, basically, a little bit of the background. I'm originally from uh, Belfast in Northern Ireland. I played in the Irish League with Limfield. Came over to the United States, spent 25 years at Penn State University. I've also coached at Division uh, Three and Division Two levels in the NCAA. Um, I spent a, a few years 